Hi everyone and welcome to a new video. If you're trying to browse the web on your iPhone but keep getting the error message Safari cannot open the page because your iPhone is not connected to the internet, don't worry you're not alone. In this video I'll walk you through several solutions to fix this issue so you can get back online. So let's get started. The first thing to check is your internet connection. Try disconnecting and reconnecting by toggling Wi-Fi off and then back on. If you're using cellular data, make sure it's turned on. If it is, try toggling airplane mode on for a few seconds and then turn it back off to refresh your network connection. Corrupt cache or stored data can sometimes cause Safari to malfunction. To clear Safari's history and website data, go to settings, then scroll down and tap on apps. And from here, navigate to Safari. Scroll down. And tap on clear history and website data. Confirm your choice. And then navigate to advanced. Toggle on block all cookies. And then try using Safari again. If none of the previous steps worked, resetting your network settings may help. Open setting, then navigate to general. From there, scroll down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap on reset and reset network settings. Enter your passcode and proceed. Don't worry, this won't delete any of your photos or data. This will erase saved Wi-Fi passwords and network configurations, but can often fix connectivity issues. Once your iPhone restarts, reconnect to your Wi-Fi and check if Safari is working. Lastly, if Safari is still not working, the issue might be on Apple's end. Visit Apple's system status page to check if there are any ongoing server outages affecting Safari. If there is an issue, you may need to wait for Apple to resolve it. And that's it. By following these steps, you should be able to fix the Safari cannot open the page error and browse the web without issues. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.